All right, boys, welcome back to another Sharon family video. Danny here, and as you can tell by the title and the thumbnail, we decided to get a winch and plow for my 2017 Can-Am Renegade 1000 XXC. So, a couple of things led to this. When I first bought this machine, definitely was more for the play rather than the work. I mean, it's a 1000cc beast, but... Some things happened that I'm gonna flash back to. Minnesota, we got a really nasty storm and uh, all I have is a blower out here at my acreage and it did not get the job done. It actually broke during the storm, but take a look at what happened. Definitely got a student head a little bit, my lord. What'd you do here, sweetie? What's up, baby? <laughs> Are you recording me? Okay, guys. This is what happens. I mean, let's start off here. This is why I'm getting a plow for my Renegade, guys. So this beast can plow my driveway, and this doesn't happen. Let, let's show them here. To get one, but two. 4 a.m. this morning. Get the white one stuck. All right, let's go the four-wheel drive Honda. Absolutely frame that one out. And now we're gonna attempt to pull this out. So as you can see guys, we had both of our cars stuck. Uh, we tried to blow around it. Like I said, the blower ended up stopped, stopped working. So we were pretty screwed. And uh, at that moment, I, did, I knew that I had to invest in something a little more practical and a little more easy. And I knew I had this four year to sit in the garage doing nothing this winter. And I knew it would be a piece plowing snow. So that's when I decided I'm gonna invest in a plow for this and because and yeah, I mean, because I got a plow, I needed a winch, so that's when I decided to call uh, my local Can-Am dealer, and who just happens to be a KFI dealer. Don't know much about the KFI brand, but that's what all this is, KFI plow, KFI winch, mounting bracket, everything. And uh, yeah, it seems to be good quality. I'll give you guys a, a closer look after I'm done talking, but yeah, horrible day, guys, horrible day. And uh, the only reason I got out is because my uh, father-in-law borrowed his bobcat from work. I'll throw a couple clips of that in. My local Can-Am dealer. Uh, I think it's called River Valley Power Sports and Marine in Rochester, Minnesota. If you guys are in southern Minnesota, uh, I'm pretty happy with the service they provided. Uh, everything was pretty straightforward. Uh, like I said, they're a local dealer for KFI, so all that stuff was in ha on hand, and I uh, didn't have to wait for any of it. And uh, that didn't go as smooth either, because uh, with my time and stuff, and my work and family life, I wasn't able to put all this on myself, so I just brought it in. But of course. On the way there, blow a trailer tire. The hits just keep on coming. Let's see if you guys can see this. Blew the trailer tire, bringing the Renegade in to get the plow set up. So, sitting here in the freezing cold, waiting for the old man to save me. So, Ay. yeah, guys, so stuck in the driveway, couldn't get out. Bring the rig in uh, to Rochester, Minnesota, to River Valley, and uh, blow a trailer tire. I have to change a tire on the side of the road, and uh, shout out to the old man. He helped me with both of those. Uh, but yeah, finally, guys, I'll throw in some clips of us. We just went and got it today, as you can see. 
Haven't done anything with it yet. Split, the blade is still brand new. Almost makes a guy not want to throw it right into the ground. But uh, the driveway is still somewhat plowed, guys. But I know there's some areas I could use this and test it on with. I've never used an ATV with a plow. So, uh, yeah, I guess here goes nothing. Hey guys, while I let the machine warm up, I uh, totally dropped the ball and giving you guys the details on the setup. So the quad is a 2017 Can-Am Renegade 1000 XXC. Uh, like I said, it's 1000 and uh, the winch and the blade is both brand KFI. The uh, blade I'm using is a steel 60 inch, like I said, KFI brand. And then the winch is just a KFI 2500 pound winch. So that's the setup I'm running. If you have an earlier Renegade like I do, like a, let's say like a 2016, 2017, I was told by the dealer that you have to buy a plate for the winch to sit on. Apparently the newer ones come with it or are already set up to have a winch installed easily on it. Mine had to bite the bullet another $130 plus labor to, to add that to make the winch sit on so just throwing that out there like I said guys never plowed with an ATV before but let's check it out
right guys, that'll do it for today's video. Uh, definitely did not need to plow today. It was more just me kind of getting the hang of it and stuff. It's one degree out today, so everything is rock hard. So that's why I'm not, it wasn't a good day to plow, but I just wanted to get the hang of it, get used to it. So far, thumbs up on the KFI brand winch and plow. The Renegade seems to be doing a good job on it too, the beast. But yeah, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, look for more rides on the Renegade coming soon. And see you in the next one.